In the 1980s, the Soviet Union looked at NASA's space shuttle and said, nice, we'll build one too, but more Soviet. And thus, the Buran was born, a space shuttle so cool it flew once, unmanned, and landed itself perfectly. No pilot, no joystick, just pure Soviet programming, and probably some angry code written at 3 a.m. built by Energia. The Buran looked like NASA's shuttle, but wasn't a copy. It was tougher, faster, and didn't need humans to flex. It survived launch, orbited Earth twice, and landed in a snowstorm on its first and only flight. American shuttles needed five guys in prayers. Buran said Niet and just did it solo. The project was later canceled due to money issues, because even legends get grounded. But for one glorious day in 1988, the Buran flew, landed, and mic dropped from orbit. No crew, no errors, just Soviet-style, sky-high. 